is a comment and an observation. My name is Awali Sukulunku. I'm a resident student working with the new CNC of Nigeria in Cape State. My, my observation goes, my comment goes like this. First of all, I would like to appreciate the Honorable Minister of Information for the transformation he introduced in the media in this country, especially those of us working in the NTA, New Zealand of Nigeria, and other federal media for setups. Because we know what we are collecting before and we know what we are collecting now, as you and the NUJ have considered the possibility and the advisability of giving us a way allowance and other necessary allowances. We remain very grateful for that effort. This has proven that you are, the one, you are one of the first ministers of information we ever had. And there is a substantial level of press freedom, press freedom in this country now since you came into power. So we are very much uh, appreciative of your effort as a minister, sir. Uh, my observation, Honorable Minister, is that Kevin State is strategically located in this part of the country and it's border two countries. And you have can you have seen and you have conquered Kevin used to produce a lot of agricultural produce. Why can't you consider the possibility and the advisability of maybe erecting an export processing zone from this part of the country so that this agricultural produce can be transported to the nearby countries for markets. Another observation side is, since I came to the state as a journalist for the past six years, KBA has been battling with one problem of lack of a federal secretary. I wish you would collaborate with the state governor so that you can have a pretty federal secretariat like any other state in this country. Lastly, sir, lastly, sir, on the issue of duty in Kevin State, I am very happy to tell you that even we in working journalists, we know we have been reading, we have been seeing cases of intimidation, cases of harassment of media members in Kevin State, and it's like an enabling environment where journalists are working freely and fairly without to be Thank you.